assalamu alaikum friends welcome to mb detectives channel and this is uh, your channel and uh, i am very much thankful to all people who has supported me who has subscribed my channel and who has shared my channel to other people i am very very much thankful and uh, due to that i have got some more confidence on me um, i brought you another video in uh, hvg system chill water valve installation so oh guys this is the area where we have did our uh, where we have uh, done our chill water building uh, video also we have previously shoot here uh, the flange building in the riser shaft and today i am going to show you uh, we are going to install our uh, gate valve and drv in the same area so this is the flange type gate valves and drv uh, above 2 inch uh, the gate valves and drv stainers all are all are will come in uh, flange and this is in my hand you can see this is a sample came along with the uh, drv or uh, gate valve uh, for the diameter inner and outer diameter of the valve so with the help of that we have cut the outer diameter and now you can see we are marking here the inner diameter of the valve and based on this uh, marking we will cut over uh, inner diameter of the valve this accurate cutting is very important uh, nor smaller nor bigger that is the that is the reason they have given us the sample along with the valves so with the help of this multi cutter we are cutting this uh, gasket and this gasket usually you can buy easily in the market means this is the rubber sheet we will buy and the rubber sheet you can cut whatever diameter of your uh, valve or uh, flanges so you have to make sure the thickness also and uh, this is uh, normally we have taken uh, 3 mm thickness of uh, uh, rubber sheet so uh, with the help of uh, the uh, the sample we have cut it over uh, uh, gasket now you can see my person is removing the particles welding particle inside the pipe because last time what we did we welded over uh, flanges here uh, so the particle will be always there inside the pipe so you must remove it will be very helpful for you if you remove the particles because at the time of testing and commissioning or flushing before testing commissioning you will have flushing of chill water system with the chemicals so the welding particles must be remo removed from that otherwise it will be stuck in your uh, drv or gate valve it will it can make the sound also due to the high pressure of uh, flushing so you must remove so we are removing whatever we can we are removing with the help of this magnet so this is very good uh, tip for you uh, before uh, you start your uh, erection of your valves in especially in the welding uh, type of uh, things you must remove the welding particles inside the pipe so we are now we are lifting here as you can see here the gate valve 65 mm dia and uh, see what this also this valve also heavy valves so and uh, i have uh, shoot this uh, video especially for the horizontal uh, installation because the vertical will be very easy but horizontal little hard in the high level area uh, because in the vertical position you can stand your uh, gate valve easily but in the vertical you need to hold this and uh, proper holding and uh, immediately you need to fix your uh, nut bolt to hold this valve and you have to insert your uh, gasket also in between so little uh, skills are required here for installing of a horizontal type, horizontal type of uh, valves so that is why i have shoot especially the horizontal uh, gate valve and drv video you can see we have a uh, hold the with uh, gate valve with the help of the nut and bolt and you must have in all uh, nut bolt you must fix washer both side inside and out you can see we have fixed already we have holded over a gate valve and you can see here also the washer both side of uh, valve so guys you have to comment you must uh, comment uh, if you like this video you comment if you don't like video also comment I want your comments I want your feedback on my videos if you want to demand any video you can demand also I want to see this video I would like this video please make I will try my best to do I'm trying my best to do so 
I want you people to help and uh, share my video and support my channel. So guys, please support my channel, share my channel as much as you can with your friends, your groups, all the other social media. As you can see, my person is going to insert the gasket here with the help of his good driver. He's adjusting the valve and making the gap between the gate valve and the flange and uh, one person is uh, inserting the gasket and you have to make sure that it should be matched both side after matching the diameter both side you need to tighten the nut and bolt so it's very simple but also some skills required the any labor you cannot stand and you cannot tell him to fix it i will guide it no the skilled person is a must for the installation of these kind of things and you can see here i am trying to show you the gasket here i came up with the camera and trying to show here i am the gasket inside but uh, i think it's difficult actually uh, with the eyes you can see but the camera you know it's little bit difficult I, you can see here the vertical also we have installed the drv and gate valve I to, as i told you vertical is very easy for installation and uh, inserting the gasket and everything but the horizontal is always difficult and uh, guys this is one more important thing i want to explain here for you wherever you install gate valves especially gate wall drv or any kind of valve which is maintenance you must check that it should be accessible and it should be free from the other services you can, you have to reach easily for the operating valve closing opening of valve and uh, because most of the times what happens uh, uh, you can install uh, during the construction but after installation of false ceiling is very difficult to reach you there because the other services also will cross from the bottom and this and that so you must coordinate and it should be in the accessible maintenance area so uh, this is very important for, uh, at the time of installation of valves so you have to make sure these things not in the riser riser always okay accessible area but other areas you must check this uh, maintenance point of uh, view so now we have already installed our gate valve now we are uh, installing our drv here you can see and the drv is nothing but double regulating valve and uh, from the riser you can see the top is the riser is coming and uh, the branch is going uh, this way to this floor so to adjust this floor uh, uh, gpm uh, we need to have a drv or later per second we need to have drv to maintain the flow in this floor so with this help of drv we will maintain the whole floor uh, flow so whatever flow you have in this you have to adjust with the help of the scale i will show you the scale is there also in the drv uh, with the help of flow meter at the time of uh, testing commissioning uh, you will use the flow meter to adjust the drv this double regulating valve so the same way of installation uh, of a gate valve is uh, nothing change here you can see they are holding this uh, uh, drv here with the help of the nut bolt and then afterward they will uh, put the they will insert the gasket both side so drv is very important part here and uh, for the more information about drv please comment i can give you the more uh, about only in drv so as you can see here so guys please comment tell me how you like this video uh, it is this for informa uh, informative video for you or you want me to make more uh, any accurate or uh, any improvement in my videos so please comment so here we are uh, inserting again the gasket rubber gasket inside the drv you can see here uh, there is a test point also there for the drv 
we will put the test points till it up this points is upper side not the bottom side so after inserting you have to make sure the pro uh, the gasket is fixed properly over there so why because you have to uh, ensure this uh, gasket is fixed properly otherwise uh, it can give you leak when uh, at the time of the pressure test so you must take care of this uh, and you have to must make sure the you are get uh, the gasket has fixed properly and it is matching both sides the inner diameter of uh, flange inner diameter of your valve otherwise it can give you leak and uh, again for rectification is very difficult after completing the false sealing so i am trying to show you here again the gasket it is difficult to see you can see the scale of uh, drv here with the help of this scale we will adjust our flow in this floor whatever uh, flow you have so thank you guys for watching my video and uh, till next video take care of yourself jazakumullah khair for watching